up boys, that's 1KDK back for another video and today I finally, finally, finally got more carbon fiber for the bike from RPM Carbon. Thank you RPM Carbon. Uh, you have yet to give me an affiliate code or give me a sponsor, but nonetheless, thank you for actually shipping this out. I ordered this thing one month ago. So if you guys don't know, look at that. Let's get it in the light. Ooh. So if you guys don't know, I ordered this piece one month ago and it is for this to kind of tie this and that together to kind of tie it together. And I opted out for this being carbon fiber as well because I kind of wanted to keep the red look or the color, I guess. I don't want to be too much black because there's already enough black on this bike. The next carbon fiber piece I'm going to get is this piece right here on both sides. Then it's going to be the chain guard and then it should be done. Well, I want to get the front yet too. But nonetheless, let's put this thing on and let's see how it looks after. I'm just going to cut to it because it's pretty boring. All right, so we finally got it on. It's not the best fitment and I'm not very happy with it, but I got it on and now this finally popped off. God, whatever, dude. Whatever, dude. It's not the best fitment. All these people saying RPM Carbons is the best. It honestly doesn't fit that well. So whatever i'm not that happy with it it looks good from like right here <laughs> anyways let's go for a ride i plan on flying my drone today getting some cool shots of the bike with the new carbon fiber this side however it looks really good this side i got it to line up pretty good but the other side no so maybe i'll retry it in the future here uh this is more down than oem so all the little scratches from the oem one you know you can see if you can see that right there Anyways, let's get a cold start on the 2023 S1000. Oh! She's angry! I haven't started her in a while. Alright boys, let's go get some drone shots. I got the drone in the back. This is going to be the first time that my drone was implemented into my videos. My second time. My first time was in the Arizona, the Arizona trip when I went down there and I rented an Indian Scout. But anyways, the bike is looking good from this angle, so I'm gonna try to fix it some more. I'm gonna try to rig it up some more to make it fit better. But as of right now, it is what it is. Uh, RPM Carbon, get your shit straight. Put it on a bike before you send it to your customers, I'm not gonna lie. I wanted an affiliate code, but now I'm not sure if I want one. But yeah, boys, there is one thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about, and I know it's kind of like, kind of off topic between bikes but it does relate to motorcycles as well short term content or short form content is absolutely ruining your brain it is absolutely ruining your brain uh, there are people on instagram that post and i am i am included in this okay we don't post any cool clips or anything of us going fast like on youtube because you guys don't really want to see that. There's not a lot of likes on that video. There's not a lot of views on that video. What you guys want to see on Instagram is a video of a bike and a stupid quote behind it, all right? And that's how I've got most of my views on my Instagram. That's how I have all of my followers. And it's pretty damn stupid, all right? As well as all these Instagram influencers, they go out and they, they ride bike for clout, right? They ride their motorcycle, they get a motorcycle for clout to start an Instagram or to get attention from other people. And this is not the reason why you should be riding, guys. You should be riding because you love the sport itself and you like hanging out with your friends that ride as well. I get it that if you see on the community, oh, there's a big community behind it, behind sport bikes, Harleys, Indians, whatever. There is a big community behind all of it. And if you want to be a part of that community, go ahead, right? But don't let these Instagram influencers that started on a thousand CC because they're fucking stupid make you be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna get an R1 for my first bike. You are going to die. You, I promise you, man, all you're gonna learn is how to go fast in a straight line. This is not my first bike. This is my fourth bike. And I know how to ride this bike, and I do its full potential. I'm not gonna lie, I don't take this bike to the track. But I know how to ride this bike. I know how to take corners, I love corners. I know how to go fast, I know what to do in uh, situations. If that car were to pull out, I, I were to know what to do. All these Instagram influencers, I got 
about the zoomies all these instagram influencers quote unquote uh they they are teaching you guys bad habits they're running from the cops uh they think they're invincible uh just please don't listen to them and short-term content i cannot wait until tiktok gets banned and i hope instagram reels get banned and i also hope that youtube shorts get banned because perfect example perfect example my giving away flowers video on youtube okay i just posted it last week on mother's day sunday i posted it uh that video i posted a whole video of me handing out flowers to moms okay and i posted that video and i made two youtube shorts with it pop it up on the screen two youtube shorts i made with that video that video barely broke 800 views but i got like probably 20,000 combined views on my youtube short kind of shitty outside. outside today is really nice but anyways back to what I was saying sorry I keep getting off topic pop it up on the screen I got like 30,000 views on my YouTube shorts but on the longer version of that video my actual video I only got 800 views now what did you think if you liked a YouTube short you'd go and watch a video well I would most people would but like these kids that are watching these videos even though my my youtube channel is 18 plus they can't sit down and watch a video they can't sit down and watch a podcast for whatever reason they just can't do it they think it's foreign they they don't like having an actual conversation with a youtuber or like you know making their mind think they just swipe and get dopamine right every single seven seconds basically they get dopamine oh there's more dopamine and I just think it's stupid, man. I really hope that you guys kind of feel the same way. Take a look back on your life before TikTok and Instagram Reels and stuff were a thing. You watch a lot more YouTube or TV or whatever it is, long form content that actually can get a message across than a YouTube short that has seven seconds of fucking people dancing in front of a fucking motorcycle. You know what I'm trying to say? like. They don't even ride their motors that go on YouTube shorts or Instagram reels because it doesn't work because nobody watches it. It is absolutely stupid, absolutely stupid. Now, of course, there are some things that, you know, oh, this guy posted that. Yeah, yeah. There are some montages of people riding motorcycles that, that get a lot of views on YouTube shorts. Okay, there are some, but most of the time it's stupid quotes, people dancing, that lake looks fucking horrible people dancing or just something utterly stupid i don't know i just really wanted to get that message across i'm kind of done talking about it uh i just hope you guys somewhat feel the same way Boop. ow <laughs> my balls dude oh god yeah this drone footage ain't gonna be that good because of how dirty the lake is but we're still gonna do it, boys. We're still gonna do it. Skirt. We're gonna have to move that tree branch. I think right there should be good. You know, it doesn't look that bad. I'm talking about the water and the bike. The bike looks amazing as always, but let's get this drone out and let's see if I can actually uh, remember how to fly this thing. It's been a while, boys. It's been a while. Man, it is nice outside today. It has been really shitty out recently. That's why you haven't been seeing a lot of YouTube videos. My goal is to do two videos every single week, but you know, it's still turning into summer here. It's still spring. So I guess we'll see how it works out. So this drone's pretty cool. Shows you how much battery percentage it is. It shoots in 4K, 30 FPS. Thank you, Abigail. She bought me this for Christmas, actually. We kind of went halves on it. This seems like $700. Low battery, that's okay. We're gonna be able to Get a few good videos out of here. Let's remember. So I just hit this takeoff button. Takeoff. 
God, my neck hurts. Oh, this helmet's heavy with the GoPro and shit. I have the AGV piece, the GP, the Forge Carbon, and my God, with all the stuff that I have on it, I have the Cardo. Use my code S1KDK on Cardo. I have the Cardo on it. I have my GoPro on it. You guys can't see it, but I'm wearing my BT Moto shirt. You know what I'm saying? Make sure to use my code S1KDK on BT Moto. They're actually doing a 15% off sale. So use my code S1KDK. Please, thank you. You will get 15% off as of right now. Right now, they're doing a 10% Memorial Day sale of BT Moto. A lot of people have been using my code recently because of the whole 15% off sale. So please use it. Save yourself some money. Uh, this is probably going to be a one-time thing this year. So if you've been, you know, trying to pull the trigger, not sure if you want to spend $1,000, which I don't blame you. There's a seagull right there. Uh, use my code right now and you'll get 15% off. All right, boys, let's head home. Kind of disappointed with the drone, but we'll see how it turns out. Maybe I'll make a cool little intro with it. I'm gonna make sure that my backpack is closed. I don't wanna lose my $700 drone, boys. I don't. That wouldn't be good. This bike is so heavy for me. I'm 145 pounds and I'm five foot six. That's when you know they're rich. They have like a driveway with columns on it with lions there, dude. That's how you know. That's how you know they're rich and they're right by the lake. today boys I don't have my leathers on <laughs> otherwise I would I've been wearing my leathers a lot recently just today since I'm flying the drone didn't really want to be too hot but yeah boys anyways I hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know down in the comments if you made it this far uh, tell me what you think about what I was talking about with short-term content tell me what you think tell me what your mind is I'd love to get my mind changed and see if it's good for the community or you know good for society I guess not really for just my community good for society I want to see what you guys think I want to see your guys's point of views I'm very open to change as long as you know your point of view makes sense but it's always okay to agree to disagree boys all right I love you guys so much make sure you use my code SMK DK and Cardo and Brentune I love you so much I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and peace